150 years ago, my great-grandfather immigrated to this region, and he and his brother started a dairy farm out on the Cairo Road. My mother grew up there. She was born on that farm. And when my father graduated from college, he moved here to work at the atomic energy plant. And my brothers and I were blessed enough to be raised by them in one of the best places on earth. This is where my wife and I came back after law school. This is where we raised our family. This is my home. It's my wife's home. It's my family's home. This community has been good to me. And I want to be the kind of public servant that tries to pay back all that generosity. For over 36 years, I've handled the kinds of cases a circuit judge presides over, jury trials. Whether it's personal injury or criminal felonies, I've got that experience. I want to take that experience and maturity I've gotten over the years to make a difference in this community, that people know what to expect. They expect me to apply the law. Now, a judge isn't a public servant like some other elected officials. We don't raise your taxes. We don't control your roads or your streets. What we do is provide justice. Nobody likes to go to court, but if you have to go to court, you want to make sure that you get a fair hearing, that you get your due process and your equal protection. I don't care what you look like, where you come from, what your last name might be. Whoever you are, whatever you make of your life, you will get a fair shot in my court. I want the courtroom to be one place in government where you can go and you can be assured that you got a fair shake. You might not always like a judge's decisions, but I want to provide people with the assurance that they got a good hearing, that they got a judge who listened to their problems. That's what the law requires. The law is the will of the people, and by serving the law, you serve the people. I am jury trial tested, circuit court qualified. Vote for me, Chuck Walter, November 8th, McCracken Circuit Judge.